Hey, it's Andy. I'm shooting a short video for you so you can just see a quick overview of what I did for Western Bankers on the PowerPoint. And remember, I'm an economic futurist, so I do things a little bit differently. Yes, I cover the economy and I cover the major things that are probably driving your clients crazy. Supply chain disruption, labor shortages, inflation. We cover all of that under the economic section. We cover uh, the policies that are being generated in Washington, D.C. to impact your sector and, of course, economic growth in a very objective, growth oriented way. But the key thing that I do that's so unusual is that I go beyond that to help your audience understand the trends that have been supercharged under COVID and showing them the opportunities there. But then we apply those to your specific industry via a case study and we run through the challenges of your industry, but then we show you the opportunities and really where growth can come from. And I think that's just really exciting for a lot of audience members and specifically for your industry. So let me just share my screen really quickly and you'll see what that looks like um, as I do this quick PowerPoint overview, and you can see, you know, we talk about the future economy, and I'm just going to run through this really quickly. Yes, we use polling, we cover Omicron, um, we cover where the economy's been, and, you know, a little bit of where we've been, where we are, and where we're going. And I'm just going to run forward right into the section where I think you'll be, have the most interest that makes me really unusual, which is this one, the opportunities in the case study. These are the three big trends that I've seen that have been supercharged under COVID. We run through each one of these with a fun story, of course, about Ted Lasso. But then here's the case study, and this is where it's really cool. The second slide I'm going to show you here is the big payoff, because I show where venture capital money is flowing in the industry, because that they do this. The reason why they put venture capital money up here, or the reason why I do it, is because they're not looking at today, they're looking at three, five, 10 years down the road. So if you want a crystal ball for the future, this is where you look. So we deep dive into that kind of detailing where money's flowing. And I think that's super important. But then we also get into AEVs a little bit. You know, this is something that's going to really uh, come forward over the next five to 10 years. And then we really get out there with space. We talk about what those opportunities are like, start looking towards this as a really great opportunity. Obviously, um, we've seen a lot of money that's been dedicated by NASA, but also anytime you see an asteroid fly by, you realize there's a big opportunities. And I also talk about why the pharmaceutical industry is super interested in space. And then we wrap this up by going over the material and then talk about this, which is get ready now. These, th this is what's so critical for your audience is to start thinking today about what those opportunities are in the future. Hey, let's have a call. Uh, just, you know, either hit reply to this email or use my Calendly link. And let's have a discussion about how we can work together and collaborate on this for your clients and where we can really get them to see the future and take advantage of those opportunities. I'm Andy Bush, and I look forward to working with you really soon.